Yeah, yeah, yeehaw. Oh, oh, oh. Whoa, whoa, boy, whoa, whoa. I'm not gonna fight unless you take off that funny hat with the buckle on it, pilgrim. Oh, not again. Get me a horse or you're dead where you stand. If you could uh, dismount for a moment, there's something I'd like to show you. All right. This saddle's giving me splinters anyway. Whoa, boy, whoa! I decided it might be good for you to have a pet after all. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you! I'll feed him oats every day. I'll even name him after you. White Beauty. It's not a horse, but it's something I think you'll like just as much. You got me a pet beach? Look closer. Bugs under glass. It's an ant farm. You're right, Willie. This is just like having a horse. You actually paid money for this? I paid $7.99 plus tax. You were robbed. An old soda bottle left outdoors gives you the same effect. You're missing the point. Alf ants are fascinating. And with this, you get a chance to watch them work and play in a natural environment. Will you call green windmills and plastic trees a natural environment? Ants don't care about that. All they want is a place to tunnel and dirt they can call their own. So where do I fit in? Well, they're your pets. You get to feed and care for them, and in return, they, they let you into their private lives. They live in a picture window. What kind of private lives can they have? Would you rather I return them? Could they be exchanged for something with fewer legs and a saddle? <laughs> okay. Here, boy. There you go. Go fetch. All right, now, bring it back. Come on. Hey, I'm over here. Alf. Hey, Alf. Well, if it isn't the Tanner kids, what brings you two to this neck of the attic? We just wanted to ask how your ant farm was going. So ask. How's it going? Don't ask. <laughs> You're not bonding like I had hoped. What's wrong? I don't know. I can't get these guys to do anything. All they care about is building tunnels. But that's what ants do, Alf. How am I supposed to teach them to sit and beg and speak? You're not. Ants aren't like other pets. I guess you're right. It's just that ant farming has a tendency to be uneventful. Sort of like working security at a Pat Boone concert. <laughs> but see, that's the way Mom and Dad work. They start you off small, and then when you've proven that you can handle responsibility, they'll let you have something bigger. So if I take care of these ants, I could have what? Big ants? My first pet was a turtle. Oh, that must have been exciting. Like watching a rock walk. <laughs> have you read this question and answer section of your Ant Watcher's manual? No. I was saving that for bathroom reading. <laughs> question. Do ants work all of the time? Answer. No. They work very hard, but they like to play, too. I think she's right, Alf. Look at those two. It looks like they're wrestling. Get out of town. <laughs> oh, hey! Look at that! He's got him in a face lock. He's going to... Oh! Oh, right against the canvas! Hey, Alf, look! Now it's a tag team match. Oh! Oh, he's got him in a 12 Nelson. That can't be legal. <laughs> Yo, Kate, I've got an etiquette question. Do you throw white or brown rice at a wedding? I'd have to say white. Don't you think, Willie? Definitely. Brown would be gauche. <laughs> Thank you. Mazel tov! Mazel tov! Throw the bouquet! Hey, In a second, Willie. I'm taking pictures for the wedding album. Wedding album? 
Hey, what's going on in here? Oh, would you look at this mess? Friends of the bride or friends of the groom? <laughs> what bride? What groom? Maddie and David, the two crazy kids who just tied the knot. <laughs> hey, come on, you love bugs. Give us a smile. <laughs> well, then look. Something is going on inside. I think they're dancing. Well, they're moving. Well, the couple on the left, Peg and Bob Beckon, they came all the way in from Tunnel 9 for this. <laughs> hey, hey, Willie, would you mind snapping a picture of me and the wedding party? I guess not. All right, everybody, say picnic. <laughs> Did I blink? I don't think so, no. You seem to have changed your mind about ants, Alf. I couldn't help it, Kate. They've made me a part of their lives. We've broken bread together. Well, actually, I broke it. They just carried it around on their heads. Be honest now, Alf. Aren't you glad I got you that ant farm instead of some silly old horse? Let's be realistic, Willie. A horse is a horse. Of course. Of course. <laughs> Well, if you'll excuse me, I've got to pick up some rotting fruit. I'm catering this affair. 